it's a very strong word, pirate box, because pirate creates fear, the skull creates fear, uh, but it's an intensive because it's uh, it, it's a provocation to the to the user. It's a provocation to the normal people, and um, so this may be a, a problem. But on the other hand, it creates again a community which is strong. Those people who stick to the community are strongly connected to the community. It is a device which is not connected to the internet and allows you with a very level with, with, with a very low skill level to show other people your content. It could be books, it could be music, it could be videos, whatever you want to, because it's your box and you have the control of the data because it's in your hand. The pirate box opens up a Wi-Fi hotspot, which is unencrypted and everybody can access to it. If you connect to it with your smartphone or your, or your laptop, um, and you open up your browser, you get a redirector to a central uh, page every time. And there you can chat, upload, and download files. The idea behind it is that you create your own box for yourself, then you get a relationship to it, first of all. The second thing is it should bring you into a situation where you can have a turning point for learning something new, learning the command line interface, playing around with it. Even if uh, we reduce the skill level you need to an absolute minimum because you have only a few commands left, but it opens up to you in a new world if you're not used to, to play around with computers. It quickly turned out that in countries where people are not having freedom of speech, they use this tool to spread their mind, to spread other ideas or maybe things that are censored by the, by the government. And so it, the pirate box becomes for those people and an interesting tool to solve their communication problems, say it like that. We are currently trying to make the, the project more um, open for modifications. It is already very modificatable, but the, the technical barrier is still high and we want to lower them. Uh, the system project library box, which is basically the same code base, we want to bring them closer together, that both projects benefits from development. The famous last words in this project are the mesh feature. We're still trying to find a way how two pirate boxes can talk to each other in a, in a useful way. So it's not only like, okay, I can connect them, but how can we create a use case or user experience that is useful and not only say, okay, this is the tool to do it like this. So this is the real challenge to make it in a, in a, in a useful way. And um, because of the manpower situation, I only can, can ask for people who want to join us to, to make the pirate box better. And we need all kinds of people, document, starting with documentation, ending with hard coding and testing. So uh, that would simplify all these challenges a lot because we can spread out the workload a bit and come with new ideas of course.